New Pornographers at number 27 on my fantasy playlist, August 4, 2002. It's called Your Daddy Don't Know. When I first heard this song, it was 12 years ago. It sounded familiar. I've heard this before. But I couldn't place it. I couldn't nail it. Well, doing some research on the background of this record, it was done by the Torontos. That's where I, that's when I first heard this record, by the Torontos, back in 1982, 83. Probably heard this on a college radio station. was not a big hit here big hit here in the states went to number 77 but it was top five in canada toronto's your daddy don't know were five by the new pornographers 20 years later it's a soundtrack from i guess a film called fubar what the hell is that f-u-b-a-r the album not sure what that is i guess it's a, a soundtrack to a motion picture i'm not familiar with 2007 blender magazine ranked their first album Debut album by new pornographers called Mass Romantic, 24th best indie album of all time. They have came under some, well, they came under some favorable acclaim by the critics. The group name, new pornographers, Carl Newman. Group member Carl Newman, he watched a film called The Pornographers. It was a Japanese film that was made back in 1966. The film was about a porn director who was coming under attack threatened, his business threatened by the government, his friends, the mob, uh, thieves. I mean, this guy just was under the gun, the director, uh, the guy who played the director, the porn film director in this uh, movie. But that's how the group, the New Pornographers, that's how they got their name, was from this film supposedly called The Pornographers, the Japanese film. So let's go ahead and do the record at number 28, the new pornographers your daddy don't know.